What's going on YouTube? Jeans here. Hope you guys are having an amazing day today. We are back yet again bringing you guys some more competitive ranked double battles for Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet. In today's video, we are having some fun with it. We are going to be using a slacking team that also features my boy Scizor. You guys are no deal. If you do enjoy the content anytime, make sure you support me as a content creator by leaving a like on today's video. And if you're not subscribed to the channel, click that big red subscribe button so you know when all of my videos go live. But before we get started here with today's team preview, got to give a huge shout out to the team creator, Alex. Thank you so much for leaving this team in my Twitter DMs. Cannot wait to use it and hopefully grab ourselves some wins here on the rank ladder. But as you guys know, slacking has one of the worst abilities in all of Pokemon called Truman. It makes it move only every other turn. So every other turn, it's not moving. That is awful. It is horrendous, but his stats are phenomenal. But on this team, we have Grafia, and Grafia learns to move Doodle, which can actually change Slacking's ability to an ally, or not an ally, an enemy's Pokemon ability. So that will remove Truant, making Slacking 10 times stronger and allowing him to move every single turn. So hopefully this little combo works out. Hopefully we grab some wins with it and showcase it on the rank ladder. With all that out the way, with all that explanation, we can get started here with today's team preview. Starting off in that top left corner, we have the one and only Gardevoir. And Gardevoir is just a solid Pokemon all around with the Psychic and the Fairy typing, giving it the choice scarf and the telepathy as its item and ability it has moon blast psychic energy ball and dazzle gleam and i feel like this is just a perfect move set for a choice scarf gardevoir second pokemon is going to be hydragon hydragon is one of the top tier dragons in the meta at the moment it's just super strong and its stats are phenomenal it has levitate and life orb as its item and ability rock and tailwind heat wave dark pulse and dragon pulse for its moves Third Pokemon is going to be Scissor. I absolutely love this Pokemon. Super great on the physical attacking side and it is really good up against every single Pokemon. Besides, obviously, like fire types and other Pokemon like that that it's weak against. But other than that, it, it has a, a lot of resistance to a lot of different Pokemon. That's Technician as its ability. The Covert Cloak as its item. Then it's Rock and Sword Stance set up. X Scissor for stab. Bullet Punch for first turn to priority. And Protect for its fourth and final move. Fourth Pokemon is going to be our support Grafia over here with Prankster and the Focus Ash. Doodle as that little ability change in move for slacking, and then it's got knockoff, parting shot, cross poison for its other moves. Bottom left hand corner is going to be that slacking. Like I said, it has Truant as its ability, but we're not going to be using it with Truant. Whenever we use slacking, we're going to want to change its ability, because I'm telling you guys, Truant is the worst ability in all of Pokemon. So if slacking is rocking with that ability, I don't want it. I do not want him. It has the Salt Vest as item, then it's got a great move set of Drain Punch, Play Rough, Stompy Tantrum, and Sucker Punch. Final Pokemon is going to be Miascarbata. This starter you cannot go wrong with on any team. Really good at countering Dondozo teams. Really good at just hitting up on a lot of different Pokemon, considering Ghost is very heavy in the meta at the moment. It's got Protean as its ability, Miracle Seed as item, and then it's got Trick Room, Protect, Flower Trick, and Knock Off. Guys, you want to write this team for yourself? Not the code is at the top right hand corner, but let's get after it. Let's hop on that ranked double ladder. Look to get some wins with this Slacking and Scizor team. First match coming at you guys, and we're going up against a really cool team. This is going to be my first time versing a Gruger team on the rank ladder. It also rocking out with Miascarada, uh, Mousehold, and then Gargle Neck, Skelly Dirge, and Hydreigon. How should I play this one? How should I go into it? I feel like I can maybe just get a doodle going with slacking. A little doodle Grafia action and slacking. I kind of like it. Match number one seems pretty good. We have a lot of different moves we can use with slacking to counter up on the seam. We have Sucker Punch for the Skelly Dirge. We have Drain Punch for the Mouse Hold, the uh, Miascarada, and also, oh, and that Hydreigon and the Gargle Neck. We have a lot of good moves for slacking. And why do I have an itch on my head? It's bad right now. I got to itch my head. I got to itch it. We got a mean itch. We got a min mean itch. Now we got to reset everything. But I'm trying to think on who we should kind of pull out for our team right here. Again, we got slacking. We have Grafia. Uh, Scissor's not too bad, but I feel like uh, a Pokemon like Hydreigon or Gardevoir in the back end could be really good. And I'm leaning a bit more towards Gardevoir because Fairy does work on a lot of different Pokemon. So I'm going to go Fairy with the Gardevoir. And then final Pokemon, I don't think you can go wrong with Miascarada. I really don't see us going wrong with this Pokemon, so I might want to bring in that. Or Scissor's not bad. Or Hydreigon. I feel like they're all great options, but you know what? I'm going to go Miascarada. Meowskarada. Just such a good Pokemon all around. Again, a Pokemon you cannot go wrong with. So we're going to lock in. We're going to lock it down. We're going to look to grab ourselves a win here in match number one. But yo, my head's still itching though. Right under the hat, man. Got a mean itch going. Got a mean itch going. You guys see me scratching my head. I'm just itching. I'm just itching right now. <laughs> but let's see who our opponent leads. It's going to be Meowskarada. And a Mousehold. Uh, not too bad. I mean, I can take Friend Guard as an ability. That's not bad. It's really not bad, and that's exactly what I'm going to do. You know, I'm going to go into a Drain Punch, went right to the Miascarada slot, and I'm just going to go for Doodle. Or can I get Protean? That would be sick. I would love to get Protean if you have it as an ability. 
Oh my god, it's dark type. Can you trash slice, please? Or can you follow me? Is that just doodle prankstered into a dark type? I should have. I had to go into the mouse hold. This could be a tough turn for us. Mouse hold's gonna protect. Okay, that's not terrible. That's not terrible. So doodle's not gonna work. We'll doodle next turn. We shall doodle next turn. Drain punch gonna fly here though. Bring this thing down to sash, yo. This thing hits hard. Slacking hits hard. And trick room's gonna pop. I don't mind a trick room. I really don't. Slacking his speed's nothing crazy, so. I don't mind a trick room, right? Let me see your stats real quick. Let me see your stats. I could terrestrialize. Your, oh, your speed's not bad. It's kind of mid. But 130, that's wild. That's wild. So I'm gonna doodle here. And I could go for stopping tantrum if I want to, but I'm just gonna go for, for a drain punch. And straight up give a little doodle action. Doodle right into the mouse hold. So we're gonna doodle here. We're gonna take away Truant for us. Look at that. Beautiful little doodle. Truant goes to technician. Oh, technician. I think a technician? That's pretty sick. But now we don't have prankster. We have technician. I did not know mouse hold learns technician. Flower trick's gonna fly here. Should be able to soak that no problem. Yeah, all day. Critical hit comes through here. Drain punch is gonna fly. Can this KO? Oh my god. Oh my lord. Slacking ripping. Slacking's playing no games right now. Not one single game. Not one single game at the moment. Just ripping into Pokemon. This is a trick him out and about, but we can just play this one slow. He's gonna throw out that little Pokemon, and I'm gonna Terra here. I mean, you give me no reason not to Terrastalize. I'm gonna Terrastalize, and we just drop a big time Drain Punch right into the Gargle Neck. And then from here, we just finish off. We just finish off Miyazurata. The reason I'm knocking off instead of Cross Poison is in case he wants to swap Pokemon, then I can take off his item. So I'm with it. It's only on one HP, so any move that hits this Pokemon is going to KO it. But yo, slacking 233 base attack. This thing's a this thing's a menace. Oh wait, I've been seeing a lot of Gargonax be ghost typing. This could get real ugly. But that's gonna be me terrestrializing, and I'm gonna hope that he's not terrestrializing the, the Gargonax. I'm gonna terrestrialize straight into fighting type, which I love. Drain punch with this thing. I'm liking this thing. I'm liking this a lot. Iron defense is gonna set up. Okay. I mean that isn't too bad. We have Miascarada in the back end. He's gonna knock off. He, he's going to take me down to 22 HP. I'm gonna KO it. I'm gonna KO the Miascarada. But let's see how much this Drain Punch does. Drain Punch coming in hot. Oh, it was a crit. Okay, I was gonna say. I was gonna say, no way is it hitting that hard. The way plus two Gargonac. Rakiyama comes through. I'm not worried about it. Knockoff's gonna fly. We're gonna say, Miascarada, get on out of here. But yo, Slack King ripping. Slack King ripping. My favorite part about slacking is he's just laying on his side. He's, he's acting like this this ain't no problem. He's sitting there like, yeah, yo, you guys stink. I'm doing this on my side. I'm just chilling here, laying down. He's going to throw out Skelly Dirge. I'm not worried about it because, you know, I got Sucker Punch here. And I'm going to just take this thing out. I'm playing no games right now. Not one singular game. Not one single game. He's not expecting a Sucker Punch either. He's not expecting it. Bro, slacking is the real deal. I'm telling you, if you can get true on off this Pokemon, it's OP. But that's why this Pokemon is so strong. Is because of that ability. That ability kind of counteracts it, but now with like Pokemon that you can swap in and out with, or swap abilities with, you can make this Pokemon super strong once you get rid of that ability. Because its stats are incredible. It hits hard, it's bulky, its speed's not bad. Sucker Punch is gonna fly here. It is fire type now. That's fine. Salt is gonna fly through here. That's gonna take me out. Ooh. I want to get rid of that Gargonac this turn. I could Sucker Punch it next turn if I want. I could Sucker Punch. He's going to go for Torch Song. Torch Song's going to rip up into me a little bit. But, again, I should be able to soak it up. Yeah. Another one will kick KO me, which kind of which kind of sucks. But I can Drain Punch really into that Pokemon now, which isn't bad. That seems Leftovers. It's over to left. And I could go into Gardevoir. I mean, Gardevoir's not too bad. I mean, Trick Room's almost gone. How many turns left in Trick Room? I wish I could see how many turns are left in Trick Room at, like, from this, from this screen right here. Did I save you? I think there's only got to be one or one or two left, right? So I could pr protect the Miascarada. It's definitely going to be my play. So how many turns are left in there? Let's check. One. Okay, yeah. So this is an easy protect. I might as well just go for a Sucker Punch here to finish off you. I just protect you. That's gonna be my play. 
That is gonna be my play. Cause once we waste that trick and we have speed. We have uh who do we bring in the back end? I totally forget already. I legit just seen it. Oh, it's Gardevoir. We have Gardevoir in the back end. We can outspeed. Kinda go from there. I'm gonna go for the protect on my Miyasco Rally and change into a pure normal type, which is actually really solid typing. I don't mind it. I don't mind that protein switch. Sucker Punch can come through here. We're gonna get rid of that thing. If I had to guess, he, he should Torch Song into my slacking. If not, that's a big mistake. Because then slacking is gonna be what I'll speed you. But I wouldn't be surprised to see him Torch Song in Miyasco Rally. Yeah, okay, so slacking is gonna drop out here. That's totally fine. This thing's sitting plus two, but it has. It does have a double hitting move with uh, Hyper Voice, but doesn't outspeed. Does not outspeed. So finally, my slacking goes down. Slacking, rest easy, buddy. I love you. You did some work. But again, we have speed all day. I can choice into a Moon Blast. I can choice into a Psychic. Whichever one I want to. And I can just go for knockoff with my uh, Masquerada. I think we're sitting pretty good here. I don't think we're sitting bad. I, th I think we kind of have this one on lock. But you never know because uh, that S. Kelly can do some work. It really can. But what's going to do more damage? This one's going to do more damage. Psychic can get a special defense drop. Let's get a special attack drop, which I like. It's not very effective on him. On fire? I think that's a lie, but... Because this is kind of messed up. It's whatever. I'm just going to go for a Psychic. I'll play safe. All right, we're going to do that. And I'm just going to go for a knockoff. Right over into it. Let's do it. Let's rip into this thing. Psychic's going to fly here. How much damage are we doing? Oh, that's some good damage. That is some great damage. Can knock off KO? One of them's going to KO, so... We pretty much win this battle. Four songs can come out here. If I had to guess, that's going right after Miascarada. Right? Yeah, Miascarada's dead, but it is all good. It is no problem. My Gardevoir outspeeds all day. He has no first turn priority moves. Psychic's gonna be able to land. Psychic's gonna clean this one up. And that's gonna be GG's. That is gonna be GG's. What a way to start off today's video with that slacking, rolling out strong. Just absolutely ripping into Pokemon. Doing a crazy amount of damage. Right now, I'm loving it. I would love to get it out there again in battle number two or match number three. But there's our final Psychic. Hits up on the Skelly Dirge. And match number one goes to us. Second battle coming at you guys. And we're going up against a meta team right here with Murkrow, Garchomp, Golden Go, Arcanine, Sylveon, and Rotom Wash. So I definitely have to bring in Scissor at some point to try to counteract on Sylveon. Because I feel like Sylveon does a lot of work up against my Pokemon. Hydrogon's not a bad lead, so we can counter Tailwind. And Gardevoir's not a bad lead here either. I kind of like both of them. I really do like both of them. Maybe we should bring in everybody but the Slack and Grip Fire combo. Makes the most sense, right? Because who could he lead? I mean, special attackers would be great in case Intimidate wants to come out here. Then, got, like I said, got to bring a Scissor in the back end. And then Miyoshka is not bad here either. Counters up onto the Rotom. I'm digging it. I'm digging it. I'm liking this. I'm liking this. So we'll leave slacking and your fight in the back end we just showcased that pokemon to its fullest potential and slacking in that first battle absolutely rip through our opponent just teeing off on it drain punches we're, we're killing it after we got rid of that truant we were thriving we were thriving we made a bad play uh for the uh, first play of the game because we went for a doodle onto a dark type but still the mouse hole protected so it didn't really matter the ne next play we made up for it gave it technician just got rid of truant that was the most important thing and that thing was steamrolling opponents. Because I didn't realize its speed was actually that solid. 130 with 233 attack? Bro. And its HP stat is through the roof. It's a bulky Pokemon. It's a bulky Pokemon, too. It is super strong. They're going to end up throwing out Murkrow and, and Garchomp. And I don't mind setting up a Tailwind here. I don't mind matching the Tailwinds. I can see him potentially Terrasalizing. And I think I might do the same. Oh, no, I do not want to Terrasalize into Ghost. I would rather Terrasalize you into Fire and just set up a Tailwind. I think that's going to be my plot. I'm going to Terrasalize you into Fire, and I think I'm just going to throw a Moonblast in this slot. If you protect, you protect. It's not a big deal for me. I don't mind it. That's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to Terrasalize. I'm Terrasalizing into Fire. I just don't want that thing to Tailwind first and then pop a Dragon Call into me. It could be a problem. It could be a problem. So with us, us matching speed, that's actually really big for us. Garchomp does protect. Like I said, it didn't really matter to me. I don't really see Murkrow doing anything too crazy. Yeah, so Murkrow's going to set up a Tailwind. Again, that, that's totally fine. That's why I said I'm cool with Garchomp just, just protecting. The real question is, does Garchomp swap, stay in, or Terrasalize? I feel like it has to tear it in the straight ground. So I feel like I should pop a Heat Wave with this Pokemon. 
just to chip up some damage and potentially get a burn and just stick a moon blast staying in this slot because again murkrow's just here like murkrow's really good on the support side but when it's like on the offensive side it's kind of just there like it's not going to do anything too crazy except for foul play on super effective pokemon that's going to be the real problem but he's not super effective onto any of my guys at the moment so i'm fine with this i'm fine with just leaving that murkrow letting it do its thing flap its little wings around i just get after it but this game really has to add some tailwind users in uh a DLC. Wimscott's got to come back. Prankster Tailwind users got to come back. They do have uh, Talonflame in here, which isn't bad. But, like, having Murkrow being the only Prankster Tailwind Pokemon, it, it's, like, not bad, but it's like, kind of weird. It's just, like, dude, Murkrow's taking over the meta. <laughs> but he ends up deciding to swap this Pokemon. Who are you going to go into? Recognize that bad. Intimidate's going to come out here. You can waste your Intimidate. I don't mind it. I'm throwing a Moonblast in that slot, which can do some big-time damage. Actually, not really. Can we get the drop on it? No. Heat Wave's going to also fly here. And I'm just going to keep chipping up some damage here. And we're going to Heat Wave there. And wow, Heat Wave did, did some nice damage. Heat Wave did some nice damage. No Barry comes out here. He's going to rip a foul play. Do a little bit of damage. And I feel like from here, I should just go for like a Dark Pulse. Or 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 a Dragon Pulse. One or the other, right? Seems like our best bet. Just to try to take out the uh, Dark on here. And then we just safely Moonblast into this slot and finish off the Murkrow. Just so when Tailwind ends, he can't just run Tailwind up and take complete speed control. Because I like our back end Pokemon. We have the Scissor in the back end. We know he has Garchomp. We have Miascravata. But he's going to end up Terrastalizing. Who are you? Arcanine? Into what? Fire? Straight fire? Normal. A normal. Okay, so E-Speed's. He's looking to fly with E-Speed. Okay. So E-Speed coming out here. Who are you going after? Can you eat this? Wow, that did some damage. That did some scary damage. I'm pretty sure I can bull punch KO that thing. He did waste his uh, Terra, so that's solid. Moonblast is going to fly here. We get rid of you. We still have Bass Gardevoir on the field, so I feel like what's called has to come out here. I feel like Scissor has to come out here because I feel like Garchomp's going to come back out. Right? I feel like Garchomp is going to come back out. But yo, Scissor looks so good in this game. It's like shading on it looks amazing. He ends up not having. I'm, I'm so cool with that. He ends up not having. Uh, Sylveon. He ends up having you, but I'm gonna have to throw a Moonblast in this thing. Uh, I might protect and throw a Make It Rain. That could, that could be scary, but. I feel like Bull Punch to KO. Actually, we're gonna double down just in case. I don't see it protecting at all. I see it just East speeding my guard over, right? E-Speed's going to come out here. That's got to go in the Gardevoir, right? Yeah. The Gardevoir does not eat. Wow, this thing's hitting hard. This thing's hitting hard. A little too hard. Bull Punch is going to fly here. That should KO, correct? My heart. That hurts a lot. And no, please. Please, no. Please, no. Um. Hmm. Hmm. The Tailwind's gone. Uh... I feel like I have to bullet punch into that and protect my Miascarada. Because once I can outspeed, I can take out that Golden Go, no problem. And nothing has to be e-speeding into my into my Miascarada. So I am just going to straight up protect here. So let's Garchomp in the back. Garchomp is scary. Yeah, I have to protect Miascarada. And I change it to a straight normal type. <laughs> so I'm straight normal. Playing no games. His speed does come out. It does go into Miascarada. Solid protect from us. I am terrified of what that Golden Go can do. I'm going to hope that Golden Go does not take out my Scizor. That could be huge for us. It could be really big for us. Because I know Miascarada can take it out in one shot with a knockoff. Let's see what he does. Shadow Ball. I think we're dead. Scizor, no! I need him to eat it up so bad. Yeah, this is not looking good. That nasty plot setup was huge. That was a huge plot setup. But we don't have Focus Ash. If we had Focus Ash, I could have let the Miascarada eat up. But now Garchomp comes out here. And is there any way we win this? Obviously, a knockoff to get rid of this thing, first and foremost. We are normal typing. I don't know. I don't know if we can win this. I do not, I do not think we can. Unless you maybe miss an attack. Well, there's GG's right there. There's GG's right there. That's a good game right there. Solid protect from him. I'm surprised he made the protect play right here, right now. 
That is kind of wild. I would have just doubled down. But Dragon Call comes out here. Brings me down to 55. Yeah, that's game set match now. I'm just going to run this one. Keep my Miyasuke ride alive. Solid second battle, but we ended up losing. You guys know the deal. We're going to hop into our third and final battle and look for a winning record. Final match coming at you guys, and this is an obvious trick room team here in match number three. We're versing a Miascarada, and Indeedy, Sylveon, Torkoal, Lilligan, and Armourou. So he has two trick room setters with Miascarada and Armourou. He could just go straight into the uh, the weather combo with Lilligan and and Torkoal, but I feel like Miascarada's got to come in here just to try to counter up on the trick room, right? It makes the most sense. I could also go into a Pokemon like Gardevoir for a lead, but I don't think that's going to be the play. I could go into Scizor. If he's going to set up Trick Room, I would love to set up a Sword Dance. I would love to set up a Sword Dance. So, you know what? I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. We're going to bring in Scissor here. And then in the backing, Slack is not bad. But I can't deal with him if it has True on. I just can't do it. I simply can't. So, I have to go back into the same team here. I have to go back into the same team. We're playing on just countering Trick Room and steamrolling our opponent. That's the plan. Hopefully, it works out fine for us. But yeah, I just can't. Like, I love slacking. Like, you guys seen it in match number one. But with Truant, it is just a waste of space. Because you're going to be able to get off one hit. They're going to... Or they're just going to protect. Wait till your Truant comes. Hit you. Protect again. It's just... It's just not good. And this is not good either. This is not good either. Uh, I could Terra. This is bad. No good. He's going to put uh, one of us to sleep. I should just go here. Knock off. I could Thrasize in water. And straight up X scissor this thing, which is exactly what I'm gonna do. I'll let my Miascarada die out. I will let my Miascarada die out. That's totally fine by me. He's gotta be putting my scissor to sleep though, which is kind of a problem, right? Kind of a problem, correct? This could get bad, it's getting real ugly. Oh, he just does that. Ah, that ain't too bad. You know, crazy. I mean, you're just gonna take on me, Ascarada. Scissor. Oh, why is that? Get out of here. Hmm. Book Sash would have been nice. But yeah, uh, I mean, we take out Logan here. Once we get rid of this Logan, we should be fine. Yeah, so Logan's gone. That's not a bad turn. Could have been better for us. Uh, I could throw Draco Meter straight into that thing. Uh, Gardevoir can come out here. Or I could go into Hydreigon. I think Hydreigon might be my play. I have Heat Wave ready to roll. I just straight up Heat Wave in them. I do have Heat Wave ready to roll. But I feel like Torkoal's a problem. Torkoal's such a big problem. He's gonna go into Armorers. Armorers comes out here. Ah! Uh, I don't mind. I don't mind the, I don't mind the Armorers. I do have Dark Pulse. Which is definitely a problem for him, so he might Terrasize. So I'm just gonna go after Torkoal. I'm gonna go after Torkoal, and I'm just gonna X Scissor down into the slot. I can see a Terra here. I'm surprised the Torkoal didn't Terra. The Torkoal Terra and our Scissor dies. But what a bad lead for us. <laughs> what a bad lead to uh, for us. Terrible lead. We're better than that. We're better than that. Let's see how some plays out. I, like, I don't... Armourish might protect or it could pop a Trick Room. That could be bad. Torkoal could protect and the Trick Room could get popped. But he knows we have Dark Pulse. And I'm kind of thinking he doesn't have the Moxie to pop Trick Room with our Dark Pulse on the field. I really don't think he has it. I do not think you have it, kind sir. He's gonna set up withdrawal Torkoal. Okay. So Torkoal gets the withdrawal here. He's gonna send out Indeedy. Indubitably Indeedy. And Psychic Surge is gonna fly. So no bullet punches for us. That's totally fine. Drop an Exorcist anyway. And the seeds are popping. The seeds are out and about. So that isn't bad considering Stark Pulse is going to rip into this Pokemon. And he's gonna end up Terrasalize. So I think he wants to pop a Trick Room and kind of roll after the battle that way. Kind of hurts. Don't really like that if he pops a trick room. But yo, X is just about to dump on this thing. He just switching the grass typing. We got bug. We got bug. I like where we're sitting here. Unless you're protecting. He's not protecting. That's huge. Dark Pulse flying. Getting off some big time damage. Can't forget about the big X Gizzy coming in here. Send it. Oh, we don't get the KO. That hurts so. En energy ball. So it goes for straight energy ball. You're going to take out Mason. No trick room here. Um, I think it's just an easy heat wave for us next turn. Heat wave double KO. I bring out my final Pokemon and we get after Torkoal after that. I'm cool with that. Cool with that. You gave me the sun. I have Gardevoir here. I do have Gardevoir. And you don't have Trick Mode. So I just got a choice to move that I like up against uh <clears throat> that I like up against Torkoal, which would be Moonblast. 
Electricity Moon Blast. So yeah, Heat Wave, or I can Psychic might be a bit better. I like Psychic. Good old Psychic. Yeah, we're just gonna go into Psychic. Plus, you got the Psychic Surge. You just can't go wrong with it. You just can't go wrong with it. Psychic Surge is definitely gonna help us out. He's gonna pop Follow Me, not knowing that we have the good old Heat Wave to finish off both these guys. That's gonna be GG's. Psychic might even KO this thing, too. Does not give us a free focus ash. <laughs> Heat wave coming out here. Yo, come on. Fla oh, that thing's flash fire. That's no good. That's no good. That's no good. What are you going for here? What's this thing going for? Kind of scared. I'm kind of scared. Aurora spear. We're dead. Oh, we eat. Okay, that's big time eats. Okay. Ah. Uh, bump, 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 bump. Torque's gonna come out here. Oh, this is scary. This is very scary. Uh. I wish I choice into like a double heading move. <laughs> We're just gonna go into Dragon Pulse here. Why go for the Flinch Chance? Flinch Chance is a bad, and I, ha I feel like I have to get rid of Armorous here. Yeah, so we're gonna get rid of Armorous here. Well, this like right, I'm gonna need Gardevoir to soak. I'm gonna need Gardevoir to soak or get a flinch. This is terrifying. We might lose. Torkoal might rip into us here. Dark Pulse coming in hot here. Big time damage and. Flinch? Flinch, please? Or eruption? Flinch. Flinch. Flinch! I love it. I love it. Good times. Good times. Good times. Flinch comes in hot. We clutch it up. That's going to be a nice, lovely winning record. Nice, beautiful, lovely winning record. You better run, turtle, or you're dead. You better run. You know you're dead. He does not run. Poor little turtle's dead. Later, Torkoal. GG. 2 and 1 for today's video. We grab ourselves an awesome winning record. What a set of matches for today's video. Rocking out with a winning record going 2-1 and, and showcasing slacking in the first battle to its fullest potential. We doodled with the Grafia and this thing was just slapping up with drain punches and sucker punches all day long. Second battle, we ended up losing, but then third and final battle, my boy Hydreigon and Gardevoir clutched it up for us in that back end. But guys, that is going to be for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know when all of my videos go live. Seriously, you guys rock out. Make sure you spread some positive day, and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace out, everybody.